Oh. Good morning, hi. This is uh, Homeless in the UK. Oh, hello everybody. It's a bit cold, chilly. This is my first time from my van. Uh, we've got the uh, 5th of uh, March and uh, now it's, uh, I've got, I got lighting here so you can see me better. It's, it could be probably even better if I had some lighting behind the camera or maybe from some angle, one angle, you know, there and there. A two degree, I have opened uh, the, there is uh, there's a window, I'll show you. It's, uh, roof window so it's like a it's like a small window for for ventilation so there is e even colder because i don't want to have any you know I, I want to get rid of the the moisture so uh i'm just setting up so be pa so be patient with me i just i just have uh, you know one short thing to say so what is going on uh as a um, few of you may know i do have a new job for last uh, let's say one and a half week or 10 days i work in a company i am not sure if i am allowed to say the name because uh, during the assessment the day you know we had to sign the uh, some paperwork about gdpr i can say that i am class two driver and we are delivering to the hospitals i think that that's enough there is no need to say more i got a my first day i ha i had an assessment i have passed they have this uh, theory and then then they have a then they have a pra practical driving this video is about can i say about personal drivers who's been working in a in a company for some times and drivers who's got experience they share their experience with me. It has been now the third driver. I'm, what, what I wanna talk about is what driver, let's call him Bob, what he told me about his wife. When you sit uh, in, a, in a cab, then you keep talking about, about so many things. And one of his, <sighs> You know, he didn't tell me like, oh, I see, you see, I have something to tell you. No, 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 no. It was like in the in middle of conversation, you know, he just he just mentioned what he has mentioned. He said that uh, uh, his, his wife is not happy with him. And I asked, you know, why is that? Uh, what, what has happened? And he said that um, his wife uh, complains that uh, he do doesn't remember the stuff what she told him the previous day when she check up on him when <sighs> the following day he doesn't remember what she said you know and uh, it can be <sighs> it can be caused by by you know different things she says you know i have told you something and you don't remember it meaning you don't care what i say and he says, of course I care what you say. I just don't remember everything what you mentioned what, or what you said. And how can I, how can I uh, explain that? Uh, what I try to say is, you know, I should probably mention, I should probably mention, sorry. Uh, I should probably mention that the, He's over 16 and they've been together for over 40 years, which is, which is, you know, from my point of view, it's a bloody long time. And when someone stays together for so long, you would say they have happy marriage and they know how to manage their marriage. And they know, you know, they, they obviously do, but you don't know, you don't know the other details. And, uh, so, so I got surprised when when he said that uh, his wife is not happy is not happy with him, and you know this is something what uh, you know if you deal with the what, when you deal with with the, with, the, with, with the problems then you don't always you don't you don't spit it out everything you don't say everything you just you just keep majority of things you keep in yourself. And then you share you share something. So I guess it might be even bigger than 
he told me where is the problem she has been uh, with uh, with him for 40 years so over 40 years you know and after 40 years you know she can spit it out that she is not happy right now because he doesn't remember okay first uh, he's over 60 I don't know how old she is but this is not important but he's over 60 so so over 60 means something it's not like if he would be over 20 or if he would be t uh, if he would be 20 years old and he wouldn't remember that would be different matter but he is over 60 and he that doesn't remember and he said that she remembers everything everything you know and so you know what I want to say what I want to say is after 40 years she doesn't know him enough to know that she, that that he simply doesn't remember every single word this is what I am saying you know it is I think after 40 years even after 30 even after 20 even after 15 years she should know even after 10 years she should know that man is not physically capable of remembering every single word what the woman said previous day man is simply not capable because there is a difference between a man and between a woman we should know that it's simply impossible for men I don't want to talk about just remembering but I, I want I want to say that most of the time you know women when they talk about their partners they say how similar they are you know how similar stuff they do but it is so untrue it, it doesn't work like that women and men are not same physically they don't do the same things they simply don't so Oh, what I am saying is after 40 years of living together she should know that and when she says that she is not happy with him she simply says that she doesn't know him and it is not his fault it is her fault this is what I say after 40 years being together you know when you are with someone you you live with him and you somehow try to understand more about him it's not about what you say it's about what you read from them if the woman says that she doesn't you know that she is not happy she's actually throwing this stuff throwing these problems on herself if she says that she doesn't get him it is not his fault it is her fault that she doesn't try to understand and if she tried to understand she would find out that maybe he is he's got it's called uh, Alzheimer you know women when they talk they sometimes they talk straight to the core and you know I love them so much you know so much on women this one I love it so much and you know exactly what they talk about and you know it's amazing how women can can go quick to the point you know this is the first thing and second thing is that most of the time women just share their feelings and when they share their feelings you know it's be honest those words doesn't have to be set in a stone it is just words what they spit it out and they share the feelings it's you know this is, this is the term when I am just saying I am just saying you know and man is simply not capable of of uh, memorizing every single word and the woman should know that and if she doesn't know that it is not his fault it is her fault I don't want to do it too much but if she would be the right woman you know or maybe the right wife if she would then she would probably understand him more and they could be even even happier couple than now 
because from my point of view be you know you know just being together doesn't mean that you are happy <laughs> women when they see the couple they are like 80 90 years old and they are holding hands they say oh this is so romantic oh yeah but you have you have no idea what what's the story behind I, you see we could go even deeper but it's it's not matter of this of this video i'm not even sure if uh, this kind of uh, content will be interesting for people because uh, when i when i look at uh, you know how many men and how many female are listening at the moment at, at the moment the the march 23 there are like 97 percent of uh, male and uh, rest of it rest, rest of it is women okay thank you for listening and have a great day bye bye